This is Brian Resney, president of Resney Wealth Management, bringing you an important update about the economy and the investment markets. Well, we're clearly into the uh, third quarter of 2018. As we had half a year point, generally speaking, the markets were slightly up, just a little bit, a couple percentage points, some down just a little bit, and some up just a little bit. We're seeing a little bit less volatility than we saw really in the first quarter of 2018. And I, again, as I've urged every investor to understand, we're gonna to continue to see normal volatility. I think the Fed will probably raise rates maybe one more time this year. I don't think it's gonna be four times total. I think it'll end up being three times simply because uh, the, I think the Fed's gonna take a, a more easier stance on the interest rate increases. But again, interest rate increases have a negative impact on various kind of bond investments, some more, some less. We've done some reallocation to our portfolios, looking for bigger growth for the second half of this year. One of the areas that's kind of uh, held off a little bit for 2018 has been the emerging markets, mostly because of the tariff talk. Now, I've had a, a number of questions, not only my TV and radio show, but also from clients. What do I think about the tariffs? Number one, we've had a, a trade imbalance in the U.S., for decades and decades and decades. This is a problem and it should be resolved by our new president. I firmly believe that past administrations for the last 30 plus years have done a horrifically poor job doling out the US taxpayer money to all these other countries and trade deficits. Our new president's gonna fix that. And all he's really asking for, just to give you an idea, is fair trade and equal trade. Let's get rid of all tariffs. By the way, almost all every country in the world has big tariffs against the U.S., and we have virtually very little tariffs against other countries. What we're asking for is you drop all your tariffs, we'll drop all of ours. It's called fair trade. By the way, China steals estimated 600 billion year intellectual property from the U.S. alone. That's a big problem. So what do I think about these tariffs and the impact on the investment markets? Basically, nothing. I do not see us having a trade war. I see our president being tough. And eventually, these other countries are going to have to cave because they need us more than we need them. But we do want them, don't get me wrong. And the problem is past administrations, again, took the easy route, meaning do nothing. Dole out the U.S. wealth to other countries. This is a problem for the U.S. taxpayer and America in general for our wealth and for your prosperity and your security. I firmly believe this will be fixed. Short term, a little bit of short term pain or maybe a little bit of volatility or underperformance of the investment markets is perfectly suitable to us in order to have an opportunity for greater gains once this is all done and worked out. I think it'll be done, hopefully, within the next three to four months because we're starting to see some cracks in the foundation and some wording coming from other countries looking to basically be a little bit more fair on their trade. This will be positive for every investor. So again, be properly positioned, which I feel we are. Again, what we see for this year in 2018 is growth of the U.S. economy over probably 3% on an a average annualized basis. Remember, we haven't seen that in probably over 12 years. So this is a net positive. Sometimes the markets stay flat and they do nothing. They're basically treading water for a period of time until they take the next big leg up. So don't be disappointed when your account doesn't go up every month or every quarter. Sometimes it'll sit there for two or three quarters and basically do nothing. Then all of a sudden it has the opportunity maybe to jump up another 15 or 20% like we saw last year. This is very normal. We again have made some allocation changes. We're holding a little bit more cash, especially in our conservative accounts because we've trimmed even further bond exposure. We like what we see in the U.S. economy. We like what we see in the emerging markets. We've exited our positions 100% in developed markets, uh, like say in Europe, because again, they're seeing even slower growth. We like the areas that are gonna grow. And the two that I mentioned, emerging markets, U.S. economy, I think are gonna be the biggest grow, growers over the next three to five years. If you're a client of our firm and you have any questions, please give us a call. And as always, schedule a review, either phone or office, if we need to sit down face-to-face. -face. If you're not a client of our firm, it's time you became a client. And as always, we always appreciate your business and your referrals. Make sure you have yourself a safe and profitable day.